Okay guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can see the removed apps from the home screen on your iPhone. Now, it might have easily happened to you that you went ahead and for example, I don't know, like a stock app, let's say it was the mail. It could have happened to you that you held down on it, clicked on the remove the app and it removed from home screen. Now, where can you actually see the app now? Like what's really going on with it? First of all, if you're looking for uh, the mail and you, you've just hidden the app, you didn't delete it, you can anytime just swipe down to get to the spotlight search and literally just look up mail and you can access the app, you can open it up and like browse your emails and everything. All right, but however, you can also just bring them back. You can also bring the app back to the home screen. So you can see at the bottom, you have the four dots right here, at least in my case, which are representing the pages. So I have the first page, second, the third, and fourth. However, if I swipe one more time, I get to the app library, which is a section where every single app on your phone actually resides. It's something like app drawer that you have on Android. Right, So it is separated into multiple different folders, you don't control anything in here, which is probably not the best, but you cannot really control or like organize it on your own. However, you can click on the search bar at the top and you get the alphabetical order of all of the available apps. So you can scroll through them and find the M in our case and here is the email. So what you can do now is just to grab the app and move it over to your home screen to bring it back. However, the important thing which you could have just noticed is that if you want to bring the app back to the home screen, you have to grab it, but you cannot grab it as in here, you cannot click on the, on the entire row or like on the, the title of the app. You have to actually go and click on the icon. So just grab the icon and now you can move it and bring it back to the home screen. So this is how it works. As you could notice, you cannot just bring it back by grabbing it by the title. You can see if I just grab it by here, I technically can do it, but it's a little bit harder, right? So it really depends the first time it didn't work, but grabbing the, uh, grabbing the, of course, um, icon is much more simpler. Now you have to like swipe it across to get it there, but you get my point, right? But this is basically where you can see your hidden or uh, apps that you have like removed from the home screen. By the way, guys, I want you to also join the Fox Tech educational platform, which is free to do so. You can join it for free and there you can watch courses on, for example, social media, dynamic island. I have a full video course video editing course, there is the in-depth iPhone guides, many different things you can join it for free and more stuff is coming in the future. So definitely something to, to take a look at. For now, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys later in the future.